You thought I fell off? You're smoking something. Hello, welcome to Wacky News. I'm Marcus J. Richardson. Carl Golder. As usual, we always bring you the most important things that you need around the life. Not around the life. Around life. Anyone who wants to be a man and stay clean. <laughs> Okay, there's nothing manly about these, but stay clean. Keeps your toilet clean. These are Mr. Muscle Toilet Power Strips for your toilet. Pine fresh. Smells like Christmas Eve. Why are you reviewing that? Well, why not? That's the question. Uh, Golder, tell us, why are we reviewing this? Well, they were reduced, which I thought was a nice touch. A clean bog means a clean mind. Now hit us with a bit of the label. Oh, okay. Harmful for aquatic life with long lasting effects. So what, you wouldn't put it in your fish tank? Don't put it in your fish tanks, don't go down to the Sea Life Centre and try and throw it into the top of the tank or anything like that. In, in the words of Beyonce, life. question, what about when you're flushing it down the toilet? Surely that toilet is not going to be involved, is that not going to be involved with aquatic life eventually? Oh well, you do the maths. If swallowed, capital letters, call the Poison Centre. Who? Hey? The Poison Centre. <laughs> the Poison Centre. <laughs> if you get it in your eyes, read the leaflet inside. But you've got exactly. it in your eyes. Yeah, so this is... this is. The... If you get it in your eyes, read the leaflet inside. Is that what it says? Yes, that's what it says, yeah. Okay, moving on. Let's have a look at the test, which isn't very scientific. We're basically just using it, so... Let's see how fresh a toilet can smell with this little fella here. <sighs> oh, shite. <laughs> Finger through it. It's fresh, fresh. You know, it hurt. How's your finger? It's all right now. Fresh. fresh. It's, it's fresh. Can you still smell it? Yeah, it's fresh. Okay. Oh, it is actually. <laughs> Which is a bit weird, isn't it? You did wash it afterwards, right? Yeah, I'll give it a rinse. Well, quick summary how was it? I mean, to put on. It was easy enough. Peel off the label, stick it on. Don't push too hard. Your finger will go through it. If it do, so, it starts to burn, and then you've got to wash it off. So it was burning. The finger was burning. Yeah, you can do if you leave it on for five or six minutes. Okay. And also, if you do push it on and get it on your finger, don't use the same finger to flush the toilet. Because then when you come back to flush the toilet, you burn your finger again for weeks on end. Okay, excellent, thanks for that. Well, let's look at the value test. So, variety of uses, is there any? Not really, no. I mean, you could freshen up anywhere, I guess, with them, as long as they'd stick. So, variety, you could probably, or if you've got kids, don't put them anywhere else, but you could. If you're a single lad, you could put them on your radiator. Which could are, you, though? You could, yeah. Is it not, gonna, is it not something flammable in it again? You know, you're like flammable. <laughs> well, you would think, but no. Let's just give it a two. Okay, then. I yeah, two out of ten. I think it was fine. Well, Go. you would, yeah. you would. I did. Okay. Affordability though, well that was a, a pound reduced, so two pound. Yes, three strips. Okay, not so bad. So, and it's four weeks per strip, so that's 12, 12 weeks. weeks, so three months. That's a lot for, of, that's a lot a of bones. Good if it's reduced, but for two quid. So there you go. Well, there you go. So we'll give it an eight. Yeah, I actually think that's probably, even at two quid, it's yeah. not so bad. That, it's good, really. it's good, mate, it's good. Well, we'll, 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 we'll,